So, John, if you could just tell me a little bit about why you like the V1X and why you play it. Honestly, because this is the ball I've played for the last 10 years or so. Is there any part of your game that you'd like to see improved with the golf ball? If you can get me to hit it straighter and longer, I'll be happy. Okay. <laughs> what iron would you like to hit to see performance differences? Trajectory? Only a seven. Let me move this over to the TP5X. That goes way higher, it's unreal. You know, a little further than the other one. Oh wow, so like, the ball speed's way higher. That V1X ball speed is 127, carry distance is 174.1. The TP5X ball speed is up at 131. It's launching a little bit higher, yeah. but with less spin. It's 184.2. Wow, that's impressive. You picked up uh, 10.1 yards. Well, I mean, the first one, let me hit another one for the Titleist. The difference in trajectory with the V1X versus the TP5X. Well, it's a lot more spin. Yeah. So any win is just... It's gonna hold it up. Yeah. You know, I was expecting the numbers to tell me, but not visually to be able to tell. You wanna try like a four iron, five iron? I, I had a four iron here. And let's see here. We're gonna start with the V1X. This is the TP5X. Damn. Oh, it's a lot farther. Jesus. 229.4. The last two shots were the same swing, you know. More height, less spin, more distance. Okay, V1X. I can tee it up and probably not get there. That's like 10 years shorter though. 222. That was 229? Yeah. This carry distance, mm -hmm. 297 versus 304. That's totally yeah, shorter. You know why? It's been higher, right? Yeah, it's the spins higher. What ball's that? Uh, TP5X. Oh. Ball speed's up, launch angle's up, which is good. Low spin rate, 2100, 312 carry. 335 total. It's amazing. Like how? How is that possible? How does it go so straight? That's my question though. That's weird. It's the same swing. There's the same swing. The Titleist hooks 10 yards more and this one stays dead straight. That's amazing. I want to see the wedges because, you know, if I'm going to hit the same distance all the time I mean, and spin it less, it will be, be pretty impressive. Good. Let's go do that right now. I mean, I can't be consistent if the ball's going to be doing that. So now, now we're talking. So we'll go back to the V1X. Yeah, that was like fate. I don't like that. Tillerman doesn't do that. I need it to be more consistent. And the range with this one, it's, it's a little better. So over seven iron, I got uh, more consistency and more distance throughout the back. And then less than a seven iron with the wedges, I got same distance, but more consistency. Definitely no sacrifices. The performance around the green is just as good or better than the Pro V1X. TP5X, it's a great ball around the green. It gives me the same confidence and consistency and control, if not more.